yo, what's up, what's everybody? Um, today is Saturday, September the 11th, the anniversary of them Twin Towers getting knocked down by terrorism. <laughs> yeah, 20 years ago, but I'm gonna get to my message though. Oh, um, just chilling, riding, about to head out, go walk about three miles right quick. Oh, my knee, this lower back starting to kill me. So I gotta do this. Um, but look, man, I've been having something on my mind. I actually had like a good friend send me an article uh, about this lady, a Scottish lady. Um, she got a deal that she got canceled because she had a lot of uh, racist tweets towards Kelly Rowland, towards um, Snoop Dogg, 50 Cent, uh, Kanye, or somebody else, we forgetting. But um, my friend that actually sent it to me, because we go back and forth all the time about is it council culture or is it accountability? Um, oh man, let me, I want to record this for him too. So yeah, we'd be saying is it council culture or, or is it accountability? And we mostly always on the opposite end. We, we agree every now and then, but I always say it's council culture. Um, he always say that it's accountability and I want to have this discussion with y'all guys because we're living in 2021 right now going on 2022 and I think I think the masses say accountability we holding them accountable but I'm like it don't work that way you say you hold your, your words say you holding them accountable but it's actually really counsel and that's the only way to go because Oh man, I'm recording. Um, accountability, that is actually something somebody have to, if you go look at the definition, that's something somebody have to do within their self. You cannot force somebody to be held accountable for their actions. Now, of course, you got people that saying like, hey, okay, what about accountability coaches? Is all, I mean, accountability coaches and things like that, of that matter. I'm like, yeah, you do have people that can help you out, but mostly that person sought out for a friend or for a family member, somebody that they actually needed help. They needed help um, in an area if they wanted to lose weight, if they wanted to quit smoking, if they wanted to get their homework done, they asked somebody, can you be my accountability partner? So we gotta go ahead and just move that out of the way. Um, but in this case, Ain't nobody asking for no accountability. What's happening is somebody do something or say something that the masses don't like, and now now it's a it's a petition for to get this person out of here. Let's stop buying their stuff. Let's stop um going to their shows. Let's stop watching their movies, etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. That's not accountability. You're you're taken away. You're taken away from that person. Now, side note. Is some of the stuff that these people do is horrible? Yes, it is. And I think real accountability need to take place. I don't think we are the ones that should be able to take anything from people. If what you should do, if you feel that strongly about it, you should stop supporting. That should be okay. Stop supporting that person. But then it gets to the council culture where, where you're parlaying um everybody to stop supporting this person and if you support this person then now you got a problem with it because somebody else supported this person because you wanted them canceled like can I do what I want to do can I listen to this person music if I want to listen to the music can I watch this person movie if I want to watch that person movie you chose to not listen to that person that doesn't mean I have to choose to listen to that person so like the difference like like council culture is us taken away from people before they actually e even learn or even accept accountability. That's not accountability. That's council culture. You doing something before somebody even have a chance to learn or make it right from it. You taking it away to force them to take accountability. And nine times out of ten, even if that person come back and apologize, even if that person come back and say, you know what, I was wrong, 
they probably would never go back to who they were, to how you was rocking out with them then because you already counseled them. That's like one of them negatives. That's like, yeah, 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 you counsel me. And I, no matter what I do, it's kind of hard for you to come back and start rocking out with me because even though I apologize, you still remember what I did or what I said. So 2021, um, I believe council culture is people that's trying to force somebody to, to have accountability. Council culture is people to force somebody to say that they, they were wrong. To it's, it's forcing people to admit they're wrong. That's not accountability. That's council culture. Accountability is when um, that person within their self admits that they're wrong. It, it take ownership, take responsibility. That's accountability. There is nowhere and no definition of accountability you can find it on any platform. There is nowhere that says that the public or the masses or the media take away from, from that person for accountability. Nowhere. You don't do that. I want to know what y'all believe, what y'all think about accountability and culture. Am I right? Am I wrong? Do you agree with me? Do you disagree? Let me know. Get, get that, that dirt off my shoulders. <laughs> Wipe my head. Ah. I don't know if y'all can see my shoes. Who walks in white shoes? Not me. <laughs> That's what we do. This is a back harness. I didn't even buy this for the purpose of my back. I bought this because I walk up, I walk up on people and I ask them, what's your life like? <laughs> what you like about your life? What you want to do in your life? So I actually have a clip that goes right here. Um that I put my phone so it can record so it can I can utilize both of my hands have a microphone in my other hand y'all see them videos coming out soon right, guys we got some deers down there I'm gonna see if they're gonna receive me as one of their own are they gonna embrace me or are they gonna run run away from me can I be a part of your family please can I be a part of your family? Don't run from me. Just want to be a part of your family. I want to eat grass too. People I know smoke it. They don't eat it. Oh, they welcoming me. They are gonna let me come. Oh, I love it. My name can be, no, don't run. No, don't run. Come here. Come here, no, don't run, no. No, don't leave me. I don't got nobody else. <laughs> oh man! <laughs> oh Jesus! Je no, I'm just playing. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <sighs> there go the only family that probably would have accepted me. God dang! <laughs> oh shoot! How you doing? I'm all right. Let's see if I got enough. But look, I got a beef with you. Because you got the name that me and my fiance going to name my daughter. And we need her to have the only name. So I'm going to need you to go change your name, okay? Ooh, hold on. Three. Take off one of the body armors. Yeah, we, yeah we, take, we, we taking off. They ain't got enough right now. There we go. We right at it now. Here you go. No real talk. I, we need. We. I need. I need you. That. Like, what's your next favorite name? Skyler. Let me see. Instead of Skyler, what about Skyscraper? That sounds cool. Now nah, I'm messing with you. But no, for real though, we are gonna name my first daughter Skyler. Sky, Skylar Michelle, that's what it's gonna be. Oh, Mom's McKay. Really? See, you need to change it. Now nah, I'm messing with you. Hey, thank you, but have a good day.
Jesus, can't. Oh, Lord. I'm dropping the eggs. Look here, y'all. Oh, Lord, Jesus. What am I doing? What am I doing? Oh, Lord. Look how I got these eggs in here, guys. Jesus. Let's pull this out. Let's restack these mugs. Oh, Lord. I can't crack them. I'm taking them back if I do. I got it. Think I got it. Hey, how you doing? Hello. All my eggs spilled. I had to place them before they cracked. Uh -huh. I had to replace them. Oh. Now nah, I would have been getting me a new one on them. Uh -huh. <laughs> have a good one. I got to remember, customers always right. Customers always right. All right. It is what it is. <laughs>